getting sweet home Alabama with my cousin and it feels so good. At the age of about 20, I was living the high life, incredibly fit, a martial arts instructor, and happy in every aspect of my life. Then, my cousin, a year and change younger than me, is moving into my parents' place for college. Shortly after finding this out, I lost my job, no reason was given, I felt screwed over. This cousin grated on my nerves when we were younger. Well, she's grown, all woman-like and whatnot. Mind you, I'd never had a girlfriend or anything. Never played the game or any of that jazz. Just been doing my thing, minding my business, and, till recently, enjoying my surrogate children, the ones I was teaching, moving along, she comes in and we start connecting in ways I'd never connected with someone before. She was close enough to my age that I had someone that I could almost relate to. I was ecstatic. Then I started to note a strange behavior from her. She would get closer to me, lean on me, touch me, etc. Could have been friendly, if not that she wouldn't do it in front of my parents. That started the gears turning, and in the wrong direction. But she was actually quite unbelievably hot. Little body, pretty face, adorable demeanor and of course those big juicy cherries. Soon, I couldn't take it any longer, and I started doing certain things on purpose. Once, I invited her to watch a movie together, and that's when I had the chance to execute my brilliant plan. I saw it on a certain website, the adult one, and decided to try it in real life. Specifically, I inserted my zucchini into a Pringles can. When she tried to take a chip, she felt- Avengers, assemble- Wait, I ain't taking care of this shit. I'll go get that. Hey bros, I look, we were without a guitar, man. I even got a pick. A, a pick? I don't even have a guitar anymore. I have this pick? Oh my god, I need to, I need, I need to go. I need Steve? Yeah, Tony? Never hire another Spider-Man again. Gotta tell. Hey guys, you seen Iron Man? Hey. What's going on down there? Man, you can't see me. I got my pick. You can't see me pick. Make it out, man. I never got rock and roll. All right, everyone. It's time to roller skate. Because Moon Girl loves to roller skate. Now, let's do it, Moon Girl magic, baby. Now, the first rule to roller skating is to have roller skaters on. You already know this. Next rule. Find a good open space to roller skate. Like this space is nickel. Anyway, what are they doing? Whatever. Anyway, let's start our roller skating. Now, let's see. First, I'm gonna do some tricks. And then, show you how to roller skate. Whoa! Yeah! I'm so glad I own a roller skating place. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Bye, some guys. I'll do some more tricks later. Munga out, Munga magic. Hi, everyone! It's Adora Bad here. So, I've been watching some Moon Girl skating videos, and, well, it's not that impressive, you know? Like, I can dance, she can roller skate. And I just think, you know, maybe we can team up and do it. Because it's not really special doing it by yourself. Also, I have Spider Ham here. Anyway, Moon Girl, if you can watch this, I want you to uh, roller skate with me and we can dance together. Um. Also, um, I got two guns. Where are the spider people? Da, Miles, Gwen, where, where are you guys? Da, stupid spider people, why are they not listen to my order? This is Miguel to every spider man that lives, or girl, that's gonna die someday. Come to us, it's back in this fucking survival, so bloody by society, man. Bye. Fuck it. I can't believe no Spider Man or Spider Man fucks are here. Fucking Miles ain't here. Fucking Gwen ain't here. Fucking Peter ain't here. Hey, everyone, if you see Miles, Gwen, there's Gwen. If you see Miles and Peter, tell them to get their asses over here. Anyway, I'm gonna go hang out with my cousin. You have a cousin? Of course I- Finally, spider people have showed up. 
Now, our next plan is to... Peter, what did you just get? A cappuccino? Why the fuck do you need a cappuccino? For Mayday. Mayday doesn't drink coffee, you dumb fu Of course, Miles, you're late. You know why you're late? You're later than your dad getting the milk. Anyway, let's... Ah, Moon Girl, I found you. Now it's time to dance and roller skate together. Wanna practice? Oh yeah, sure. I would love to practice with you. Now, let's go. Oh yeah, I got the best dance move in the world. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, you don't. I know how to hit the gritty, if you know what I mean. Uh, I can hit the way way. All right, let me see what you dab on those eight. I'm gonna sick of my you. Well, I'm going to roller skate on your ass. Well, I'm gonna punch you in the cooch. Hey, hey, you you know what I'm gonna do, you two? What? What? Get the fuck back to work, you motherfuckers. God, he's angry. Oh my god, Mrs. Shar. I didn't mean to throw my pee at you, even though you're yellow away pee. Oh my god, I'm wet like my girlfriend did to me like- Hey, devil dinosaur. I need to ask you something. Come over here. Come, come here. Rawr. Do you like me? Huh? Do we make good friends? Mm huh? Good. Please don't eat me. No. Brooke, seriously, why always me? Why do I have to be in his belly? Why can somebody else not be eaten? Why, devil? I thought we were friends. I don't want to go in your stomach. It's gross. No, get me out of here. Well, I'm stuck here again until he throws me up. Hate it. Hate it. Devil. You do know that I meant hot dogs. Ah, oh, boy. Ah, uh, no! Oh, man. Now I need to find a way out of here. Devil, what the heck, man? Or dinosaur, or whatever you are. Oh, dude, did you really have to eat me for breakfast? Urgh. Let me out of here. I am not food. You know I meant hot dogs because I had hot dogs in my hand. I, not me. I'm not stupid enough to be your meal. I wasn't even on the menu. Now I need to find a way out of here. Ugh.